Hi there, my name is Fred Karnowet and today we're going to talk about how 2.4 GHz can be used for a control line scale. In 2013, 2.4 GHz radio control was approved for use in control line scale and carrier. So this is a typical RC system that is used in radio control all the time, but we're going to use it for a control line scale model just like they would in RC. So it comes with a transmitter and a receiver. Now if you turn the transmitter on, it has model memory. Now that's this is the throttle stick, which you see this is the throttle servo and, and typical glow engine. You can also have flaps and that's a, just a toggle switch up here and you see that servo there going back and forth. You can also, this is a two position, two position switch meaning that it'll be there, middle, and full. And I use that when I want to drop the flaps halfway and then full. Um, you can also run retractable landing gear. Now this is an, um, an electric retract. So it, it plugs in just like a servo does to the receiver. And then just like that. So and if you had two if you had two retracts, just take a Y harness and put both retracts through the Y harness. This is the battery, which plugs into the on-off switch. This is where you charge the battery. This this sends power to the receiver. The red light means you got power. This is your throttle servo, channel number three. It goes here. So that does that. This channel is the retracts. And that is your flaps. Now all of this, since you can't look at any of this while you're flying, you do all of this by feel. And it sounds hard, but it really isn't. Once you practice it a little bit, it works just fine. So good luck with your next project. Land softly. Bye.